So this is Kozaki Irina, and I got her from Ame Ame's pre-owned section for about 43,180 yen. Now she is of course a binding bunny and if you've seen some of my other videos you know that I have a few binding bunnies and this one has been on my radar for a while now so I just decided to go ahead and pick her up. Now there are a few things about this particular figure that I don't like but I will get into that later on in the video. So for starters I really like this figure. I really like the design the concept and the color palette that they went with i really like how they went with white fishnets versus black fishnets because the black would just stand out too much comparing it with the colors on this this figure now i really do enjoy how her bunny suit is kind of like a two-piece it's not a one-piece bunny suit all of it connects together and i will be displaying her exactly like this because if you take off her top you know, it's just, it doesn't make the figure really stand out no more. It's just like another basic nude figure like the rest of them. So yeah, I guess I'll be displaying her with her top and her bottom on just because I really like the look of it. And the outfit really sells the, the whole concept. Even though I know I have said in the past that if you are buying a binding figure what's the point of not showing their goods well the point of showing not showing this one's goods is because if you take the top off like i said then you kind of lose the aesthetic of the figure so that's why i'm leaving it on so i guess i'm being a little bit hypocritical now the sculpting on the entire figure for the most part is very nice generically like what binding would do you know I've have I have a few of them, so it's pretty much exactly the same. They don't really disappoint you. The hair sculpting is actually really good on the back side. I'll get to the front side in a little bit. The face looks really well done. The I guess the body, the entire body sculpting, everything about that was really done well, especially her privates. The only thing I really have to complain about for this figure is just certain areas on her hair is not really flushed out doesn't really look that well and yeah i wish they would have spent just a little bit more time with the hair although you know looking at it from the back side everything looks fine it's just getting up close to it in personal it just doesn't look as well as it could have been if they spent a little bit more time on it and i do understand that this is a pre-owned figure so that may have something to do with it, although I really just think that ma the majority of the issues with this figure is the quality control directly from binding themselves. If they just maybe spent a little bit more time flushing out the small details, it would look a lot better. But overall, I still really like the aesthetic of this figure. I really like her pose. It's really, really nice, really inviting love it a lot i like her outfit and i really like her face she's really cute and i would recommend you get her if you see pictures before you you buy her that is it for me click this right here see you guys there love you guys peace out